Hello, a warm and windy way away welcome to you. I've been thinking a lot about bridges this week. As you can see down here, it's a bit of a case of mind the gap at the moment and I need to rectify that. You might remember I built a bridge for Rockery Corner. It took me absolutely ages and I want to avoid that happening again because it should not take me that long. Anyway, I've been considering my options and I came up with a few ideas of what I might like to put down here to bridge this gap. There's something wonderfully elegant and striking about the massive brick-built viaducts you get all over the country, which can be emulated quite well with a cast concrete viaduct. There are various kinds of girder bridges I could build, they'd be very nice too. I also considered building two bridges because then I could start the curves outwards before it actually gets to the baseboard, which would save me a bit of space. And also I've got this stuff. And I thought if I used it this way up, I could cut an arch into it and put some detailing onto the sides to construct something similar to the bridge at Tannibal on the Festiniog Railway, which I've recently discovered and think looks rather lovely. After a quick scrub, I measured up and cut each piece to size with a hacksaw. The bridge will be constructed essentially from timber, with one of these sections screwed to each side. You'll notice that I have splayed the ends out in order to help with the transition into the loop on the baseboard. It took a while to cut out the arch and I got through two Dremel cutting discs in the process. I ended up with this which will be a fine base for the detailing that I mentioned earlier. And apparently there's a big storm coming so I decided to anchor my baseboard using rocks and a tow rope. I've also piled up bricks on top of it although I didn't show you that. The plus side of this is that I've now got somewhere to put my bench again since all the rocks are now underneath the baseboard. Lovely day for it. And I'll just have to hope that tomorrow I still have a garden left. 